Prince William has written the introduction to the book Earthshot, How to Save Our Planet, to be released on September 30th. This book, written by co-authored by Colin Butfield and Johnny Hughes, will be a companion to the 10-year-long Earthshot Prize initiative, founded by the Duke of Cambridge. Its pages will highlight the urgency of the environmental challenges faced by the planet, showcase studies and feature contributions from the awards council members. Given William's commitment to environmental causes and long-term projects, royal author Duncan Larkham believes William is now the royal family's star performer. The Duke, the commentator continued, is focusing on where he needs to be and where the royal family needs to be over the next 25 years. Speaking to OK Magazine, Mr. Larkham said of the Earthshot book, people should look at William's foreword as the manifesto of a future king. He's putting himself absolutely at the forefront of the environmental movement. Highlighting how William's project looks at the future, Mr. Larkham added, we've got a society now where Greta Thunberg and young people are calling for urgent action. When William becomes king, those young people will probably be around the age William is now so the environment is a very useful cause for William to associate himself with. The Duke of Cambridge launched the Earthshot Prize in October last year. The project will see the Earthshot Prize Council award £1 million to five winners who have presented workable solutions to the world's greatest environmental challenges. The council includes people who have demonstrated a keen interest and commitment to the environment and its protection, such as the Queen of Jordan, actress Kate Blanchett, football player Danny Alves and naturalist Sir David Attenborough. Prince William will also sit in the council. Earlier this year, the Duke announced the first ever Earthshot Prize Awards ceremony will take place in London on October 17. William comes from a prestigious line of royals interested in the environment and conservation. Prince Philip worked tirelessly for decades to help advance conservation and protecting nature. He passed on this interest to his firstborn Prince Charles, who for more than 50 years has been championing environmental causes. In the early 70s, he started voicing his concerns for plastic waste and air pollution at a time when these issues were not mainstream. Earlier this year, in a fresh bid to revert the climate crisis, he launched Terra Carta, a charter aiming to unite business leaders in the commitment to go green and make their companies sustainable. Last October, William spoke warmly about what he learned during the years from his father's efforts in favour of the environment. Appearing on BBC Radio 4, he was asked how he perceived Charles's comments on the environment. He replied, I regularly wonder what my father's banging on about and am sure every son thinks the same. But no, publicly, with my father's environmental credentials, HES talked about this for a long time and long before people cottoned on to climate change. So I've always listened to and learnt and believed in what HES saying. But I know it's a very hard sell, 40 years ago, to predict and see some of the slow-moving catastrophes we're heading towards.